Hello guys, my name is Christine. You can call me Joseph. My name is Ivan and this is our vlog. Hello guys, it's me Christine from the Philippines and Today we are here at my dorm. Today's challenge is called Introduce Your Living Spaces. Enjoy the tour. Good morning everyone. It's Joseph here. I'm right outside my building. And today I'm gonna show you my room. Hi guys, it's me again, it's Ivan. And I'm back here again with another episode together with two of my friends, Joseph and Christine. And uh, I'm actually just gonna go buy some hairspray first and then we are gonna go home where I am gonna introduce you to my room and my house hello again beautiful people we are back home and we can finally start with the house tour we have a fraternity which is the place where I live and it's basically um, a house with a couple of rooms inside and the people who live in the rooms share the common parts like the kitchen, the von Thema. But the difference between the von Gemeinschaft is that this is actually like a huge house. Like there is a lot of space here. Everyone in the house has uh, his own bathroom and toilet. Now I am gonna show you my room and then we can go out of the room so I could be able to show you the house. <music> our living room this is the place where we just chill here on the right we have my favorite piano I actually played the piano when I was little but I stopped and now I started again when I moved here because I just love music uh, here outside you can see the garden there we have our barbecue so we are back in my room um, I just showed you my house guys I'm hoping you like this video I'm hoping you had a nice day I'm hoping you had a nice impression of my house Without further ado, let's go inside. This is the kitchen. It is not very big, but certainly very clean. Because every time someone cooks, they will clean the kitchen back to the nice and tidy form. Welcome to my room. Let me do a quick spin to show you around. Look at this space. And I really prefer the wooden furniture, except from the cold steel furniture. But with all the advantages, there also comes disadvantages as well. For example, this bed. I think it's a little bit small and a little bit hard. But overall, I really like this room. And now, let's go outside and see what's around my building. A supermarket over there it's only five minutes away by foot and the tram station is over there eight minute bike walk and now let's go to my university although the rent here is three times more expensive than in Taiwan I still really like the dormitory here because in Taiwan you have to share the room with four people and sometimes it gets really frustrating if you have different living habits and here I really appreciate the personal room and I think that is very important finding my accommodation for me was really easy the school handled everything for me and I just walked in like a guest to summarize it all up I really like the room and the surroundings the only problem is the pricey rent actually some other exchange students got a, a smaller and cheaper room so I recommend you to send an email to the school and tell them which room you want. That's all from me today. We're, by the way, currently at Oststadt, which is the eastern part of the city. Um, and this place is really convenient. It's just four minutes walk from the nearest grocery store. It's also four minutes walk to the nearest tram stop. And from this place to my university, it takes about 12 minutes by the tram. And we are now at one of the most important parts of the flat and you might have guessed it already, we are at the kitchen! I love this place. I spend a lot of evenings here uh, because I love to cook, especially Filipino food um, when I'm missing my mom's cooking. And also this is the place where um, the entire flat meets and just spend some time with each other. 
Right over here is an important part of our kitchen. This is our puts plan. Um, this is basically a schedule of who is cleaning what on which day. Um, I'm due to actually clean it. So welcome to my bedroom. This is probably the place where I spend most of my time in. Yeah, I love this place. This is basically a place where I can relax, chill, and just recover. So how did I find this place? I just went to the Facebook group page of my university and it, it does happen. You can find places there. Try to do that if you are looking for a place still right now. I think we have come to the end of the tour. I hope you enjoyed checking out my crib. Yeah, so thank you so much for joining me in this tour. I hope that you now have a better glimpse of student life uh, in terms of living accommodations here. I hope to see you in our next episode. Thank you for joining me. And all right, bye. I'll see you next episode. Bye. And I'm going to see you in my next episode. Bye, guys.